welcome to Tuesday's video. Let's dive right into this lesson. Now pause the video and read these phonics words. You will be writing a test on these words on Friday. Read the words and write the words out five times. Remember that practice makes you better. Our sight word for today is does. And does means to do something. Or it means you are doing something. I can use it in a sentence like this. The smart boy does his homework. Or the clever girl does her homework. It means to do or it means you are doing it. Let's read the comprehension together. Crocodiles. Crocodiles have long tails and big jaws. They are both very strong. They have hard, dry skin. Crocodiles spend most of their lives in the water. They often come out of the water to relax and rest. Crocodiles lie in the hot sun and wait for their prey to come to them. A crocodile will lay its eggs in the soft brown sand. Small crocodiles are called hatchlings and they eat fish and insects. The big crocodiles like eating fish and birds. Some crocodiles eat bigger animals, mainly large birds. They can stay under the water for up to five hours. They go to sleep in winter. This is called hibernation. Crocodiles can be very dangerous and if they sense danger, they can be very destructive. A group of crocodiles is called a float. Humans need to respect crocodiles as a crocodile can kill a human if given the chance. Now you are going to look for nouns in your comprehension passage. If you have the comprehension in front of you, underline the nouns in red. If you do not have the comprehension in front of you, point on the screen. The answers will show up on the next slide. So pause the video so that you don't see the answers before you've done the activity. I've underlined all the nouns in red for you. Pause the video to check your work. Now you are going to look for your verbs. If you have the comprehension in front of you, underline the verbs in green. If you don't have the comprehension in front of you, point on the screen. The answers will pop up on the next slide. So pause the video, do the activity, then press play when you are ready to see the answers. I've underlined all the verbs in green for you. Pause the video to check your work. Now you are going to look for punctuation in the comprehension passage. Punctuation is capital letters at the beginning of a sentence, full stops at the end of a sentence, and commas when we are listing things. I want you to pause the video, look in your comprehension passage for the punctuation, and color them in yellow, then press play to check your work. Here's all the punctuation colored in yellow. Pause the video to check your work. Let's continue with our shared writing. Yesterday you looked at the picture and you discussed the picture. Today you are going to be finding words that relate to this picture. Here is an example of a word box. I want you to take any piece of paper that you have at home and draw a word box that looks like this. Then I want you to go back to the picture, look at the picture and fill in these columns. I want you to find at least five words for each column. You are going to look for who words, what words, describing words, doing words and where or when words. Remember that who words are proper nouns. Those are names of people, places and things. 
With your what words, you are going to look for common nouns. These nouns don't get capital letters like the proper nouns do. These nouns are nouns that you can see, touch, feel, hear, taste and smell. Then you have your describing words. Remember that describing words describe our nouns. And your describing word must always match your noun. Then you have your doing words, your verbs. It's things that you can do. Look at the picture and see what the children are doing. And then your where or when words. That's where the picture was taken or when it was taken.